I'm sure we've all seen some type of movie where a person will have a devil on one shoulder telling them to do something and then they'll have an angel on the other shoulder telling them to do something different. And that duality is a real part of being human. And what I like to refer to these two voices as is the lower self and the higher self. We have so many different voices in our heads. Sometimes it's hard to figure out which voice to listen to. It's not as easy as they try to make it seem like in movies where one voice is telling you, hey, you should rob a bank. And then the other voice is like, no, you shouldn't do the right thing. It's not as easy. <laughs> it's not as easy as they make it seem. So let's first talk about the lower self. The lower self will always say things to keep you in a low vibration. So envy, um, egotism, laziness, these are all traits of your lower self. Your lower self will always choose the easiest route because it's all about maintaining the status quo. So let's just say you wanna lose weight and your lower self tells you, why don't you just work out tomorrow? You've had a long day. Why don't you just relax and watch some TV? And guess what? A month later you look up and you still haven't worked out because that voice just keeps coming back every day and you keep listening to it. The lower self is all about keeping you from growing. And a lot of times the lower self voice used to be the voice of a real person. It may be the voice of a parent that always used to put you down or a teacher that always used to put you down. Um, so what happens is we adopt their pessimistic views and we don't even realize that somebody else is shaping how we think. Your higher self is all about pushing you closer to your highest potential. And a lot of times it's hard to listen to your higher self because it'll, it'll tell you to do something that you're either too lazy to do or you're too scared to do. But in the end, it'll benefit you more. And whenever I'm too scared to do something, if I know it'll better me, then I do it. If I'm feeling too lazy to do something, if I know it'll better me, then I do it. It could even be something as simple is seeing somebody else succeed and you feeling jealous of them. But instead of feeding into that feeling, you congratulate them. That's, that's an example of you listening to your higher self and ignoring your lower self. But whenever you find yourself in a dilemma and you don't know which voice to listen to, always ask yourself, which voice is going to better me? All right, that's all I have for you guys. And um, if I don't post another video for a few weeks, it's because I'm in the process of moving. And um, I move at the end of this month and I have yet to pack anything. Um, so yeah, I really need to focus on that. Me and Greg are moving into a townhouse. I'm super excited. Um, but I've been in this apartment by myself for five years now, so it's going to be very interesting. It's going to be a very interesting experience. And um, yeah, so if I don't post anything for, you know, a few weeks, I'm not missing. I just, you know, need to handle my business. And um, I love you guys so much. Peace, love, and hair grease. Adios. Bye. <clears throat> this is Vanilla Drop. <laughs> Stop messing me up, nigga. This is Vanilla Drop. I'm coming to y'all niggas. Y'all ain't ready for these motherfucking bars. Oh, my bad. <laughs>